What's up, Burris family? I am down here in Florida with Rob from Deer Meat for Dinner. We were doing a bunch of thermal hunting the last couple of nights. We had a good time. Make sure you guys go check out those videos. While we were shooting those videos, you were getting a bunch of requests for some thermal stuff. So what are we gonna do? Well, you know, so many people want to thermal hunt. It's, it's new. Typically, you hunt during the day. Thermal opens up the nighttime, whether you're predator hunting or trying to hunt invasive, destructive animals like wild hogs, in our case, Thermal really is a, is a unique way. So, so many people have said, we want to do this. And I was like, let's just give some away. So I got a pretty good idea. That's what we'll do. How about they go to your channel, subscribe to Burris Optics, obviously subscribe to Deer Meat for Dinner. Find this video. If you're watching it, that means you found it. And then leave a comment. After 30 days, whichever comment has the most likes and the most comments, the most feedback, you're gonna get a brand new, what is it gonna be, handheld? Yeah, we'll do a handheld. Cool. Yeah. And handheld's gonna be really good because that's a way that you can scout in the morning. Like, let's say you're going to your deer stand. No light, you can just look. Ooh, you might see some deer feeding and instead of bumping those deer, you can work around them or just back out. Like, let's say you're going into one of your food plots, you're looking, oh my gosh, they, they're already there. Absolutely. Now you can back out, either go to a different area or just back out altogether because sometimes it's better to back out than to move them and bump them. That's right. Um, thermal also is a safety, device, a safety device. Zara uses it all the time. We have a big yard, we have a lot of fans, and you know, when Sarah hears something, instead of flipping on the lights, she just creeps out, looks with the thermal. It's a really, really good yeah. tool to use around the house. No and um, it's fun. It is fun. It's addicting. You got to look out. <laughs> Once you start doing it a couple times, you're not going to want to stop. And then you're going to have to remember that you need to sleep. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've got a 6.5 Creedmoor and I've got a 243, both top of the first thermal scopes. And it's, it's such an effective, fun way to hunt. For sure. Yeah. And in the West, we see the same thing with coyotes, right? Those, those coyotes that start to get nocturnal, they realize they get a little call shy during the day. You turn the lights out on them and it's, it's game over. So yeah. Yeah. So anyway, you guys, go check out Burris Optics and subscribe, leave a comment, and then tell your friends. Just go on your social media, tell them, go thumbs up, like, comment on your comment, okay? Yep. That's the key. Whichever one of these comments gets the most feedback, gets the most traction and the most likes, you're going to get a brand new scope in 30 days from today. So that would be mid-January. Yep, that's right. And since you guys made it to the end of the video, since you listened all the way, there's actually another video going, or another giveaway going on right now on the Burris channel, so you can actually enter twice. One for the handheld here in this video, then there's another one floating around you can go find. But yeah, if you subscribe to the Burris channel, you're going to get all kinds of the videos that we've been doing to help people basically learn how to thermal hunt. We did a whole series on coyote hunting, how to be better at night with thermal hunting. Anyway, dude, it's really been nice having you yep. down, man. You guys, Good dude right here. We went to the Bucks game. Oh, we yeah. hunted. We've had a lot of fun. It was a blast, as always. Thanks, Rob. We'll see you guys soon.